What's going on, people? And today we are we are going to be reviewing the Hoham Gimbal. I've had this thing for about four months, so let's get into this. Okay, so what comes inside is this right here. Um, I connected my phone, so you have to, yeah, it doesn't come with a phone, I'm sorry. So it comes with a phone, well, I'm joking, it does not come with a phone. Um, it comes with a gimbal and a little tripod that you can put on if you want. I just have it on so you can see it. And then right, right here, right here on the side, you will see little lights. And if you hit the power button, it will tell you how much battery you have. So right now I have three, so that's enough. Uh, this thing can be a phone charger, it can, well, a uh, power bank, it could be, um, you can add some accessories to it as well, but just standard, comes like this. So in order to turn it on, you have to hit it two times. So one, two, and hold it, and then there you go, and then it's on. So right now, it, it looks pretty stable. Uh, that's going to be a problem. So it looks like it scrapes a little bit. That's not supposed to happen. Um, but I think it's because of the phone case. Here, let me take off the phone case. So I'm going to disconnect it. Okay, um, so regularly you don't want to turn this on unless you have the, um, unless you have your phone on it and make sure it's connected via Bluetooth uh, or it will freak out and you'll probably break the gimbal. Um, so yeah, this thing can, I think there's attachments for like GoPros and stuff, but I just use it for my phone. Uh, this is actually what I record the TDHS on. Um, so yeah, and there you go, and it automatically just stabilizes itself. Yeah, that's a lot better. And see, I am holding it in place, and honestly, it's actually doing a pretty good job. Okay, um, I think I can move it uh, sideways. Yeah, it's on sideways, so I'm going to hit it one, two, so there's a button right here where you can hit it one, two, three. Uh, and it will stay in place so unless you move uh, unless you move it like this so literally I am turning it right now and it's staying in the exact same spot I mean this is this is look at this it literally looks like it's floating in there um, my, re my review on it um, like I said I record the TDHS on here uh, I used to only film it with my phone um, but now it's like it's more convenient to use this because you hear you hear a lot of static uh, or me adjusting the phone but now you don't hear anything and you don't even hear the motors like, like you don't hear it, it it's literally silent um, and then on the sides of course we have a USB port uh, and the charging port so like I said power bank um, there is a Hohem Ho app so in order to use the use these features, the zoom and the record button, um, you have to be connected to the uh, to the to the Hohem app, and without that, uh, you can't use it. But I honestly don't care about that. I honestly keep it the same way no matter what. Uh, and those face uh, and those facial. Uh, there's facial recognition, so it'll literally follow your face if you set it on the Hohem app. Um, me personally, I don't like the Hohem app that much. Uh, it crashes a lot on iOS, I don't know why. Um, in my opinion, it's a pain in the ass. So I don't, I don't really use it, that's just my opinion though. Um, but also, just disclaimer real quick, this is not paid or endorsed by Hohem or any company trying to sell me their product, I actually bought, uh, well, I got this product, 
uh, for Christmas. But I am, um, yeah, kind of right now. So literally right now, I am literally shaking the table and it's staying still. So, um, my overall review on it, I think that there's, like a gimbal does the same exact thing. The thing that, um, the only thing I don't like about it is that it, like the buttons, like the, the, um, the little joystick, it kind of feels, like, it feels really cheap plasticky. So I always, you always think that you're going to break it, in my opinion. But up top, with the uh, motors and all that, it it's durable. And I ran with this, and, you know, it kind of, it works. But in this case, you can only go uh, 600, 640 degrees, I think. That's like two times around. But, um, almost. But yeah, right now, uh, you can tell, so there's a little light right here in the bottom, well actually on the top, and it blinks how many, it blinks, so in my case it's blinking three times, it's telling me that's what mode I'm in, I'm in AL mode, so basically I can't move it at all unless they use the joystick, and yeah. So. Um, it works with any iPhone, honestly. It works with any phone in particular. There is an app for Google Play and there's an app for iOS. Um, but yeah, the, this is... It, it's just kind of crazy that this is a, just a consumer gimbal. Like, a lot, most people take selfies with it or like take it on long uh, or vlogging with it. Um, in my case, that's exactly what I do. I take it and I just kind of mess around with it, I guess. So. Anyways, um, this thing just comes in a case, comes with the case, little charger. Um, I have a billion of them, so I don't always use that one. I kind of always keep it in the case, just in case. I <laughs> just in case, um, just in case, and I don't have it on me. Um, I think it works the best when you don't have your case on it, and sometimes I can get in the way. Um, but yes, there you can adjust everything on here, you can adjust the weight and everything. But just for the normal phone, I think it works the best. And um, yeah, so the Hoham app um, will save the footage, it'll save the videos that you shoot onto your. Um, onto your camera roll and you could just hook it up you can either edit with iMovie or export them like I do uh, but yeah that's kind of that's kind of it um, running with it still very stable um, I've I've tried a lot of uh, I've tried a lot of uh, a lot of features like if you watch a video right up here um, it's when I was reviewing the D why I bought the DJ Mavic Air versus the Mavic 2. Um, I was actually using this and the facial feature and it was following me. So if you guys want to, go check that out. Um, but yeah, this is kind of it. Uh, the Hohem Gimbal, I recommend it. Uh, if you guys have anything else that you would like me to review. Um, I did get a request and I just got the $20 headphones. So I have the $20 headphones and versus the JBL uh, clip, of course, that will be in another video. Um, but yeah, that, that's about it. Uh, make sure if you have any questions or anything about this, I'll be, I am free to answering all your questions in the comments below. And make sure you guys join the camel pack. I mean, only members stay with the channel. Anyway guys, see you guys in another video.